So I made a video a little while back of me skating that Walmart braille board that I paid $15 for. And people, the video did really well. I think people were surprised by how well you can skate a board that cheap because it's like made surprisingly good. Uh, but today we're gonna have someone who's actually authentically really good at skating, skating it. Uh, it's gonna be John Bradford. Not ready. And I, like we were just talking about like ideas that we could do with it. And he said that there's a 14 stair. He was like, oh, there's a 14 stair. And just a real quick forward. So we're gonna, it's not even probably gonna be like a video where it's just like, oh, we're gonna work our way up to whatever. Like, I think we're just gonna go to this 14 stair and he's gonna try to ollie it. Just bounce out. And real then quick. just roll out. Well, I imagine he has to skate flat ground on the board a little yeah. bit. Well, there's an eight stair too. So we can warm up on the eight. And yeah, then yeah. Just go for it. Yeah, don't even, don't flip your board down the eight. <laughs> just go straight for Alex. I don't know how durable this fucking thing is. So we're gonna, <laughs> we'll see what happens. We might get a 14 star ollie on a board that costs 15 dollars through and through i haven't altered anything it is the trucks the wheels the bearings the grip everything that came with this board is what's on it so is it the ones that come with plastic on it yeah. oh no dude wait you said you gotta tighten it yeah it's already too way too tight yeah, that's gonna be ultimate wheel bike dude that's yeah you're gonna land super perfect that like sounds like a real ollie man uh-uh, don't be doing tricks that you could break the board yet. Get that thing over here. That's a good shot, look at that. <laughs> what the? I'm gonna end, do the ollie, and just go, Woo! I've been sitting, what, what size is it? It's like 775, I think, or 8765. I'm um, skating at 85. So for me, it's like a drastical difference. Oh, I love the word drastical. So they, there you go. I sacrificed two of my bolts so he can... Uh, be as safe as possible. So it just so happens though that where this 14 stair and all these other stairs are, it's like a pretty bad bus. So it's not even like we're gonna go over there, have a fun warm up session, like build his way. Like it's gonna get it like straight to go time. So I say skate some flat ground here, maybe ollie off that curb a couple times. <laughs> yeah, cause that totally matches up to a Well, if you clear the gutter, that's at least a two stair. I think I'll be fine. Okay. That makes one of us. Oh, yeah, you got, it, dude. dude. Here's a skate tool if you need to tighten it up. Oh, look, he's trying to loose it in the gutter so he doesn't have to try. <laughs> I, I did definitely loosen it as loose as it would go so I could skate this it. This T tool definitely doesn't work. Oh, I might have another one, actually. Actually, <laughs> I, I definitely have another one because I'm an adult and I carry literally three T tools at all times. See, I got a classic plastic T tool, which is the one that he's using. There, it cracked. Ruby Lily broke it somehow. Uh, and then I have, of course, the silver T tool for when you want to tighten stuff because it has the ratchet thing. And then I have this ace one, which is just like solid metal, so it'll never break. So this is the backup backup. Yeah. Oh, see, that feels way better. Oh. Probably the best kickflip I've ever done on that board. <laughs> on a real board. Oh, I got you. Let's go. <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> Yeah, the wheels are a little soft, but that's what you want for a, you know, a beginner board. You don't want to be power sliding all over the place. So let's say, hypothetically, we get in here and we get the boot right away. Is there another hefty set we could jump down, like maybe a 12 or something? Because yeah. I'll drive to Hollywood High right now. I don't give a shit. I don't, I, I want to see what this board can take so bad. Because that's the one thing that I didn't do was, to, you know, test its durability. And this is my logic. When you walk up a flight of stairs at a hotel, it's usually seven and seven which means roughly 14 stairs is one story. That's my logic. So you're alling one story. I think you're gonna roast the eight stair first try at least. Max weight, 200 pounds. Oh, hell no. Oh. <laughs> Yo, jumping off of stories plus me, definitely more than 200 pounds. <laughs> what do you have, like 170 something? Yeah, like 160. Oh shit, I'm 160. I'm 168, dude. I got all this hair. While we're walking over there, I might as well uh, plug the fact that John Bradford has a YouTube channel that he's been uh, plugging away at. He's gonna be uh, uploading more frequently starting probably by the time this video comes out. So, yeah, so be ready for that because this is how good he is. Well, I feel like they're gonna see us and be like, oh, they got skateboards, like we should kick them out. But then they see that you're riding a Walmart board and they're like, oh, they're not skating. Dude, he's fine. <laughs> yeah. He's like, he's not doing it, dude. <laughs> Dangerous, he'll be all right. It's a really good downhill manual pad. Go for the, the selfie world record. <laughs> I was gonna say, your warm up could have been a 12. That's the 14 right there? Yeah. We can't get back there, can we? I mean, I probably have it. Okay. Oh. 
Oh, chill. How rare is that? <laughs> like, usually those things are always locked. Is that the eight right there, straight ahead? Yeah. So we used to just come here and skate this every day. That makes sense that you used to skate here all the time, right? Yeah. And all that time, you thought this was an eight stair and not the seven stair that it is? I'm pretty sure it's seven, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to say that right now, too. That's <laughs> wow, this thing is perfect. So small. Oh, my God. My first ever trace flip was down. The first ever kick flip, trace flip, backside flip. But that don't mean nothing though. That, that, that's a fluke. You got this right here. Yeah, Dave Pachinski. <laughs> tiny board, big kick flip. Exactly. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm so nervous. Was that wheel bite? Yeah. Oh, but, well, it was an ollie. I, I don't know who I'm kidding. I almost want you to not do this kick flip because I think it's going to get in your head. <laughs> oh, it stained the wheel. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, that's what we're going to do. You're gonna, you're gonna crank that thing down. I like to blame you. Obviously, it's not the board. See, my issue with this board was I couldn't make the trucks loose enough uh, for how I skate. But the trucks, if you skate tight trucks, you're gonna be a-okay on this thing probably. <laughs> Wait, is that car? Oh, wait, wait, wait. There's like a worker literally on the other side of this gate. You can do the 12 if you want. Wait, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. It's 13. I gotta double check every set. Okay, this is probably like an eight. Okay, now we're looking at this shootout handrail thing that John's talking about board sliding with that board. Oh, this thing's a little uh, bit hefty. Sticky or slick? Slick. The bondo is gone, so it's a little spooky. Coming back around. So should you hit the board slide and we leave, or so, should, we, should we walk away and come back? Let's just walk away. Okay, we'll walk away. Because either way, he's gonna leave out that way or come back around this way. Yeah, I feel like he probably saw us looking at it. All right, so it looks like the cop kept driving, so we're just gonna run over there. He's gonna hop on a board slide real quick. Something goes well. <laughs> then we'll go skate something else, maybe. Almost fell riding up to the rail. Do one more. Do one more what? Oh, like board side to Fagy? You can if you want. He also told me that this shootout rail is a uh, three stair. It's four. He's only been right about one set of stairs today. <laughs> yeah, that's long waiting. I know for a fact you could probably throw a feeble and crook on this rail too, but. No sense. That's what I was kind of thinking, like, what if, what, what the grinding would be like? The, the trucks grind okay. Yeah, I, was, I remember when I skated, I did like a front hurricane on it and stuff on a flat bar. I kick flipped it, but I don't have the footage. I did it with my homies a long time ago. Like, nobody, I was when I was young. You need to come back and get a photo of that. Yeah. So over this handrail into this handicap bump? Yeah. Like, look at that. It's like, it's perfect. No, it's not. Don't say that. That's The angle is terrible. The landing is narrow. There's all kinds of stuff to get tangled up on. You need to come back and re-kickflip that. Yeah. Look at this spot. This is the spot naturally here. Butter benches with literal round coping on them. Like what? California is so stupid. Like everything is skatable. All right, so before we roast that 14 stair, let's, let's build our way up. We got a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, or as John would say, a seven or a nine. And then right here we have a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, uh, or a 13 if you ask John. Oh, it's getting weak. Like it was nothing. This is actually a really good spot, huh? This is like a bring your board back, do let me let me let me pick for you real quick. Oh my god, please, 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 pretty please come here and do back three, front three. 
Ooh, that'd be a good one. Yeah, that's the one. Please do that. Down though on this board. Oh man, let me get a look at this. Bondo's coming up. So uh is it like a can you take a run up or yeah, he doesn't know what he's about to get into. I don't even know how I want to it's <laughs> it's so not small. <laughs> <laughs> you don't it's, like it's in my hand, it's not bad. I obviously said it's cool, but just in my head, like I don't know what's gonna happen here. Yeah, at all. I don't either. <laughs> Listen, you don't like like I, I'm honestly, you do not have to try this. We could go somewhere else and do something else. Here, oh yeah, I got you. Oh, it's getting serious. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even have to go past either. Oh, I'm just gonna finish. Right, go for it. Yeah, you got it. A little, a little scared. A little scared for him. I always like when I watch people try stuff, I always put myself in their shoes and like try to go through what they're going through. Nah, I'm probably more scared than he is. Braille better turn me pro after this. <laughs> Braille better turn him pro after this. I think, I don't know. I don't know what's gonna happen. I don't know if the board's gonna break. I don't know if he's gonna stick to the trucks. All right, that's all I wanted to do. That's all you wanted to do? Well, like, just for my like, I just felt like now I'm like okay. I jumped off of it. I shall land on the board now. Feel bad? No. I, I think I think you got, you're gonna do it. I'm just not gonna over here like try to finesse the ollie. No, no, don't do anything cool with your ollie but land it. No, now is not the time to to look good on a skateboard. It's not even like a baby 14. Like it's just like a legitimate 14 stair. If you watch my channel, I've definitely talked my friends out of trying stuff. I have a lot of confidence in John on this one. They're not getting hurt. It's just gnarly. Right when I went to pop. Oh, your truck's dead? Yeah, I went like. Because <laughs> ah, it wanted you to throw front heel. I think he's gonna try to stick this one no matter what. Just judging by like the comfort that he's had on the first two bales. I'm usually pretty good at guessing what John's gonna do. Because I usually guess that he's just gonna land it, so. Oh my god! <laughs> Dude, that board is still together. Oh, yeah, you could. We already know it's official. You can jump down a 14 stair with a Walmart skateboard. You don't have to do it again. I kind of, I, I kind of made the point. You can, you can land it if you want. I know how you are. Okay. Keep in mind how centered he has to land to get a good right away because on a four stair kick flip, no, I'm sorry, a three stair kick flip, he was getting wheel bite and sticking. So this is that plus 11 stairs, you know, pretty, pretty easy math, but this is a whole other world. He has to land so centered and not let his wheels touch at all. She's uh she's saying we gotta go. All right, we're heading out. Can you get one more and then we'll leave? What the oh, yeah. Did you do it? Yeah, I see you, yeah, just do it. It's an Ollie. You already stuck it. And if you don't do it this try, that's okay. It take it took four try or three tries and it didn't break. I know. Point that's is, actually really good. Yeah, it's kind of insane. Alright, here, last try. Oh yeah, that's good. One last try, 14 stair ollie on a $15 skateboard. You do the math. Yeah, that one, you float it. I can't believe it is that. Dude. Yeah, like, no, no, no pussy footing yeah, on that ollie. Like, cause like before I was kind of just like, I, I wouldn't snap it, but that one I'm gonna get out of here. Wow. Well, it's a legitimate seven ply board, I guess. It's just. That's why I said in my last video, if you ride this size already, you could get that board and swap out maybe a little bit of the equipment and you'd be fine. Literally, new bushings, new bangs, new bushings, new bangs, new wheels, new wheels, perfect board. Yeah. Crazy. Even, even, even Any other board wouldn't have had it. Any other Walmart board wouldn't have been able to do it. You wouldn't have been able to even get to the set. Yeah. You wouldn't have been able to push fast enough because those bearings will fucking so roll. Legit bearings. Yeah, no, they spin. Uh, yeah, so this is uh, why I like surrounding myself with skaters who are this good because I'm obviously never going to push a Walmart board past a fucking five stair. 
<laughs> yeah, pass the fly <laughs> Pass the curb. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, like I said, John Bradford, he can uh, do stuff like this on this channel. He uh, definitely doesn't hold back for YouTube or Instagram or any of his platforms. He just, like, goes all in. So go check him out. Follow him on Instagram. Follow him on YouTube. You don't do TikTok, do you? Not really. Hell yeah, adult mode. Uh, yeah, so yeah, all those descriptions or all those will be in the description.